Hey guys, welcome back to a brand new video. Now today we're going to be looking at my Bath and Body Works haul. That is all Halloween that I had picked up when I went to Bath and Body Works because when I was there in Florida, of course, I went for the Halloween stuff. And there were some really good bits that now that I'm back, there is a huge sale on. A lot of this stuff is actually 50 off or more, which is annoying because I would have bought so much stuff if that was the case. <laughs> I'm going to show you my little splurge haul of things I bought and some of the ones I had to buy here because I couldn't bring them back with me because of weight restrictions in my suitcase. Without further ado, let's start off the savior of the pandemic, which was the hand sanitizers. Now, when I went in 2016, 2017, I bought so many of these because these are so cheap, these little anti-back hand sanitizers. And then my mom was like, why did you buy so many? And I was like, well, mom, you never know when you could need a hand sanitizer. And then boom. Pandemic happens, COVID, we needed it. So I was stocked up, to be honest. Now the ones I picked out for this was, I got two of the Halloween range ones and one of the other ones. And the first one I'm gonna show you guys is the Whiskey Reserve. Now I liked this one, this was a fun little one. It smells more of a alcoholic cologne. I have to say. Yeah, an alcoholic -y type cologne. It definitely has the rusticness of a whiskey blend in there, mixed with just a bony type aftershavey scent. The Whiskey Reserve one, I just got one of because I feel like it's one I'm not gonna use too often. It's very overpowering. One that I really liked was the Pumpkin Apple and I've already kind of used a chunk of that. It smells like sweets to me. It smells like an apple -y sweet but it's got the cinnamon tones mixed with some pumpkin scent pumpkin spicy scent and i really like it it's the pumpkin apple and when i smelt it in the store i was like i'm gonna get two of this one because i really liked how this one was kind of smelling the last one i got which is probably probably my favorite scent out of all of them oh, i love this one is the moonlight graveyard my wrists with this one because my hands covered in the other one i don't know how to describe the scent but it is a really nice scent. It's fresh, kind of like a florally, like high in a perfumey smell, but it just smells really good and I really enjoy it. So I ended up getting two of this one, which is the one with the little blue bird on the front and it's a blue gel. I also picked up this and it is a skeleton hand. That, the skeleton hand glows in the dark and it's got like, it's all silicone and it's just to hold your antibacterial little hand sani in there. I usually do it with the lid turned upwards, but I think you can have it the other way if you wish. So it just doesn't leak out or anything or someone wants to like mess with it. That's what it looks like. It also does this. How fucking cool is that? There is no way to change the battery on this. So I have a feeling that once the battery is out, it's definitely a gimmick and I bought into it. It was half price off and I was like, okay. The hand sanitizers were like five for $7. Whereas here in the UK, it's five for 15 pounds, which is $20. That's extortion. It's double the price for these. So when I go, I do kind of stock up a little bit. I have weight permitting in my suitcase. Moving on to scent wise, I picked up a mini of the Fine Fragrance Mist. Now these, I ideally use these for when I clean my room, change the bed sheets. I do two sprays of this, just do, and that's enough. It fills the room. It smells really nice. I enjoyed the sweet whiskey scent. It's, uh, it's kind of like the Whiskey Reserve, but a little bit more subdued and a little bit more fresher kind of smelling. I can't put my finger on it, but it smells of something that is very American-y and I can't think of what it is. And they'll probably come up to me after the video is done. But I do really like this one, the Sweet Whiskey. I still have these ones from years ago that I am slowly getting through. I don't think there's an expiration, but I've only used it this much in about 40 years because I have, this, I have three of these. I have a blue, which is the Wild Blackberry and Vanilla. I have the Praline and Pears, and I have a Pumpkin Marshmallow that I'm still burning through, to be honest. These are the Foaming Hand Soaps, and I got the Perfect Pumpkin one which I've had the hand sanitizer of this before. As you can see, I've been using it. It's in my bathroom. I just brought it up, but I love this. This is such a soothing feeling hand wash and it's, it makes you feel really 
clean and also it soothes your hands too. It does have what, it's got vitamin E, shea extract, aloe, and natural essential oils. And I feel like that because other soaps that I have like from Lush or something, my hands feel a bit weird afterwards and I don't know what it is. But these foaming soaps always are really good. They are a bit more expensive here, sadly, but I think they're worth it. And you know, you can never go wrong with a good hand soap. The other one I got was the Moonlit Graveyard, of course. I really like this one. I may actually end up buying another one of this if it does go on sale. It has the same scent as the hand sanitizer. If you like that scent and you really wanted to get the foaming hand wash, I really suggest this. I also wanted to get one of the holders too because I think it would have got broken if I brought it back with me because that's so much stuff. So I'm waiting on eBay to get one of the holders. <laughs> and second to last, what I'm going to be showcasing here is one of the candles. Now, I got this candle from Next because Next is our exclusive brand that actually has Bath & Body Works here and I signed up to their credit account where you pay it off over three months or whatever because if you did you got 10 pounds off so with that I was able to afford one of the candles because I'm not paying $36 for a candle. I'll pay it if it's reduced. So I got the Moonlit Graveyard Candle. Now this actually goes with all of the other stuff that I have showcased with before and it's got the same scent pattern. What I love about this is the lid looks like an Oreo ghost on the top which i think is really cool and i really like this like stained glass motif around the candle as well it smells so good it's a three wood candle i don't even think i really want to burn it like <laughs> hopefully it will go on sale but i really love the candles the candles in the states are beautiful so hard to bring back in your suitcase what i did manage to pick up because you need something to hold that candle right i picked this up this is the gold Halloween candle holder that happens to be a clock. And as you can see, it is another clock. I am recording this super late. Look at this. This is heavy. This was $70. It's actually on sale right now. You can get it for really cheap. I managed to pick this up. It's really heavy. And it can only work with the Bath & Body Works 14.5 ounce candles. You have to be careful because this may get hot. But this is what it looks like. It's got a really nice face. This face actually glows in the dark. It's also removable too. So that's what it looks like without the face in it. And then you screw the back off and you put the battery in. But yeah, that's literally it. It is so cool. The detail of it, I thought this would look really cheap in person. Like I thought it would be plastic. It's full. Can you hear that? It's, it's hard. It's not hollow, full on metal. And it holds the candle on the top. That is the back with all that stuff going on. I didn't realize it would be so perfect to hold the candle. So you can have your candle burning on the top of this. Drop it, there you go, look at that. That's what it looks like. It's really cool. I really, this is my main purchase from Bath & Body Works, which I am obsessed with. And the clock works. That's it guys, that is my Halloween Bath & Body Works haul. I hope you guys enjoy this. This is always something fun for me to make. Since I made this video on October 11th, aka my birthday, by the way, I made this video on my birthday. Yeah, that's it. I hope you guys have an awesome day. And if you like Bath & Body Works, let me know if some of your favorite products or scent ranges to try out down below. Maybe I'll look it up. Have a great day, guys, and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.